Well, this is a nice surprise. It looks like we have a problem here. And unfortunately, some people think that apparently you can be safe by wearing Gucci face mouth masks to protect yourself from COVID-19. And there was some backlash from a YouTuber and a TikToker called, called uh, Taylor Holder, who uh, apparently made a tiny bit of a, a mistake which he probably should even do. And uh, I have some uh, tweets here that I really want to read about this. So here we go. It reads from Messy Monday, which says, Yikes, Keemstar and Taylor Holder shared a few words as well. Which says, Bro, you scumbag for that and you know it. And then Taylor Holder says, a bit aggressive, huh? You're a grown man, and so am I. If you want to know any details, feel free to message me. Messy Money also tweets, Oops, Mr. Frida wasn't here for Taylor Holder's new merch, which reads, Influencers capitalizing on a global pandemic by selling non-medical grade face masks to free teens is not a fucking move. Natural selection do your thing and Taylor Holder be better. There were definitely people who were against it. Like this person who tweeted, This company sent me a little off a little today when they followed up about a mask sponsorship I ignored the first time. They thought I ignored it because I missed that it was paid. Ain't that irony cute? Mr. Preda replied, and that's a clapback. Which is probably in response to Taylor Holder's new merch, which, uh, I have more tweets to read of uh, people who are practically not are against it, like this person. Those fronts to him even apologizing is even scarier. Nobody thinks it is wrong. Like, fuck y'all. And then it's... It says, sue me for saying this, but I saw nothing wrong with the face mask and I generally don't think you need you should, you should have had to apologize for this. The ones you think got offended were probably boomers. The world's gotten too damn sensitive. I didn't see anything wrong with it. If I'm going to wear a mask out to avoid getting sick, why wouldn't I want to look good doing it? You weren't in the wrong. They're just haters. Um, yeah. I have more tweets about this and I'm going to explain why people are, people meaning girls, are defending Taylor Holder for doing the wrong thing, which is not really a good idea for COVID-19. Here's a response to this tweet. Agree with, with a fan who just said what I just read just now, which says, Agreed. He was feeding off of fear for profit. He won't get it. I agree. No sense only when saying it was alright. I agree. I really don't understand what was wrong and people got offended. You were so mature, Taylor, but honestly, you weren't in the wrong. You even said that they weren't for medical use, but 
for design and passion with reason behind it. For real. How are people gonna come for him if his fans literally ask for them? All oh, this is the reason I support Taylor. He uses his platforms for good. Why are you apologizing? You did nothing wrong. Nah, he definitely should not be profiting from it. I'm not trying to be a social justice warrior here, but it's a serious virus. It, honestly, I think he handled it well by apologizing and donating. He made a mistake, but he fixed it. The only creators I support are people like Taylor who actually have a good heart. Taylor, you don't need to apologize. You literally have nothing to apologize for. He did. Because, you know, that mask is not 100% uh, for COVID-19 protection. And people can die. So, you should donate the mask to local hospitals they are in desperate need of them right now. No, he doesn't because they don't work. Why would anyone get offended? I'm confused. When you watch this video, you'll find out why. Can someone explain why though? Like they looked normal to me? Uh, they are not. It's not for COVID-19 protection. They're the most human, generous, and amazing childhood person I know. Yes. When he makes a mistake, He's generous enough to donate money, not masks, that cannot protect the health care workers who are saving people's lives. There's nothing wrong in face masks. People say that people that say there is have no right to. If you want to make masks, then you go ahead. Like, more people need to know about COVID-19 and the fact that you're donating the proceeds to charity is amazing. You're a good human, Taylor. Don't apologize. You have no good intentions and they saw the past all the good you were promoting. I am really sad you're taking it down, though. Y'all take shit re way too seriously. For real, I've been getting attacked all day from defending him. People take things way too seriously because it's a deadly virus and a mask like that cannot be protecting you in a t time of need. Come on. If you wanted to buy real masks, at least order one from, from what's it called, uh, Amazon and or you can go to... Uh, any supermarket and buy those masks there but you do not need to buy Gucci made masks to look cool while you're protected for COVID-19 because it doesn't work like that am I the only one who saw nothing wrong with what he was trying to do I thought it was a good idea you weren't even the only one who done it if I had to wear a mask, I definitely would have gotten one to wear over the normal boring mask for sure. <sighs> nah, s well, actually the normal boring masks are actually better. So, yeah. I don't really think there is a need to apologize. Yes, there was. He made a huge fucking mistake. People are too sensitive nowadays, and you can truly see who actually supports you and who don't, El Mayo. Well, uh, yeah, because you are all brainless 10, 11, 12 year olds who are going to agree with anything Taylor has been doing wrong. You will agree with any person that has been doing wrong, and you're going to stick by that? How stupid can you be? Wait, those offend people? That's crazy. Those masks were so cool. Well, I'm sorry, bub. You are forgiven, though, even though you didn't do anything. No need to apologize. You were doing the right thing. 
I'm sorry you were getting so much backlash on this. You did nothing wrong. You really shouldn't have to apologize. Love you. Your intentions were in the right place. Some people clearly don't understand that even though the masks were cool, you're not COVID-19 or, or should I say CDC compliant. These masks should not be on, on the internet for their fans to buy. And I know that for sure because parents who have a child who is a fan of somebody like you, Taylor, they are not going to allow their own child to buy a mask that isn't protectable from this deadly virus and it could kill them way more than the normal boring masks. You didn't invent us. You were trying to raise an awareness. I'm always behind you to support anything you do. You did nothing wrong. I feel so bad that you are getting backlash. You are an amazing person. Just try to show his fans love. Wow, people don't get intentions. They just judge. I'm sorry, Taylor Holder, for having to do that. We love you, Taylor. Some people are just so sensitive. Keep your head up. Yes, because... People are sensitive because a mask that he suggested is not up to code for the CDC and in fact would be kind of useless to use. From a non-fan standpoint, I know your hard intention was in the right place because I know the type of person you're... Very mature of you to make it public apologize, but it's unfortunate that not everyone understands you. Sending my love and support your way. Brendan, please learn how to spell. Nearly don't see how he was in the wrong. Uh, because these Macs are not up to COVID-19 co code. I just said that. I support you, no matter what. There is no need to apologize. You are a great man. He did need to apologize. These masks, again, we're not up to COVID-19 code. Wake up. You didn't have to apologize. You did nothing wrong. I love you. Oh, come on. How is that offending? Because it is. I'm not going to say it again. How is selling masks that says... F COVID-19 to help raise awareness about the seriousness of it. I cannot. Well, that kind of mask that Taylor Holder wants to sell is not up to COVID-19 CDC compliance. That is why. We all make mistakes. Yes, Taylor makes a lot of mistakes. And this one has to be the biggest mistake of all. You don't owe anyone an apology. You're literally such an angel, please. I love you. I wasn't offended at all. And I'm at risk as well because of my immune system at times. Like this, we need to laugh and to be happy. Don't feel bad. I wanted one. People are mad sensitive. What the fuck? People are not sensitive about uh, protecting you. And everyone else who may be infected by the virus if you choose to wear that stupid mask. That's so stupid. He was just trying to help and be considerate to the elderly and these haters come and have to go and make it seem like a bad thing. I swear I hate these people. Go get a life and stay out of other people's lives. 
Well, Chloe, you are so wrong because these masks are not up to code. If you knew that, you understand why. Maybe this comes with my age, but I am unhaunted to anything, especially if nothing was nothing wrong was done. So you of you people to need to find something better to do with your time and stop attacking people who are trying to help during this time. Brittany, you need to learn how to spell better and uh hello. If uh Taylor did something that isn't up to COVID up up to C D C guidelines per se the mask that he wanted to sell um people may die from the virus and you guys will be infected because that mask does not really help protect you from the virus it'll just become worse over time and uh yeah you only should get mandated made doctor approved masks to to protect you not these gucci worrying unapproved doctor protected masks Oh, BB, thank you for being mature. You didn't deserve all the hate. Love you so much. I low-key wanted one. I love you. You are such a good person. <sighs> hey, Taylor. If you're watching this, I want you to tell your fucking dumbass fans and educate them on the deadly pandemic and why this mask that you could have sold to millions of your fans, which would have gotten them sick, would not work for them and their families. And explain to them why they are not approved by a doctor. Unless it's doctor approved, like this boring mask, as they say, then really these masks that you were about to sell online is not appropriately able to be protective of our kind, which will make the numbers gone worse if you had if you then had sold all the masks to your fans in the first place. So I am glad that you did not proceed to sell that stupid fucking Gucci made wearing masks. Because again, they are not doctor approved. So yeah, thank you for that. Just please. Educate your fans. Educate them on why these masks are not doctor approved. And we can all go home. Or, or should I say, go back to our normal lives. And maybe they will understand a lot more. If they ever get to watch news, of course. Because... The news has a lot of information about the virus and how deadly it is. And why only these boring masks can only protect those who really need them. So yeah, please educate your fans. Please. Oh yeah, before I go, here's the apology that he sent in on Twitter. I apologize to anyone I offended. After much thought and consideration, I am taking the face mask down. My intention was to raise awareness for my generation about the seriousness of COVID-19 truth trash and the disclaimer had been 
up front from the beginning. All proceeds from sales will be donated to Meals on Wheels to support those fighting for our most at risk senior citizens. I urge all my fans to please stay home during this time and listen to the recommendations of CDC and the WHO. We will all get through this together. Yeah, okay, good. I'm glad Taylor Holder apologized. Which might have happened right before all these idiotic comments from his hands. So yeah, that's about it. Thank you.